Hello, everyone welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you are new to my channel, welcome to our YouTube group family. Today we are going to learn that how to edit photos for e-commerce in Photoshop. I will show you three methods to edit the picture, and we will retouch the picture for final results. So let's get started. So let's start by importing the photo. As you are well aware that Amazon does not allow images with background or any text. So let's remove the background. I am taking the pen tool to make a selection and none of the other tools can compete with the pen tool in making a selection. Simply click and drag until it creates two handles for you. Click on the point you created while holding the Alt key. It will close one handle, and you can adjust the path with other handle. There are few things that should be followed while using the pen tool. First, don't start from the edge, always start from the center. Second, always try to create handles in that direction in which you want to move forward. Hold the control key while changing the position of the path. Always click before the edge and then make a curve instead of clicking at the edge and make a sharp edge. Always go for a round edge because it will give you a better selection. Right click and select make selection or press ctrl plus enter to make selection. We have selected the shoes now. Simply click on the lock to unlock the layer. As we have selected the shoes but want to remove the background, not the shoes. So we'll invert our selection. 
Go to select and select inverse. Now we have selected the background. Simply press delete to remove the background. Let's take a new layer and save this for the web. I am taking a size that is highly recommended by Amazon. Adjust the object into the canvas. Press Ctrl plus T to transform or you can turn on auto transform. Select both the layer and adjust this into the center of the artboard. So here I can feel there are some issues with the sole of the shoe. Let's retouch this. Hopefully, you have enjoyed this till now. Let's save this for the web. Simply go to File, then Export, then Save for Web. Simply press Shift plus Ctrl plus Alt plus S short key. I will recommend you save this to maximum quality. Let's check this into a folder. So it is looking good, is not it? So let's get back to Photoshop now. I want to share another method that you can use to remove the background. Simply select the object selection tool and just make a selection and it will try to find out an object in that specific area and will make an auto selection. So it makes selection quickly. There are some issue let's correct them by quick selection tool.
So here is the result. Now the last method to remove an object is simply going to select, then subject. This is the fastest way to make a selection of the object in Photoshop. Hopefully, you like this short tutorial and learned something new. Please tell me comments on which method you like most. For me pen tool. If you have not subscribed yet, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Hit the bell icon for the latest updates. Thank you for watching.